Assalamu alaikum, this is part 2 on how to deploy your React app on a VPS within minutes. Last time we set up our VPS and installed Node.js and npm. Now it's time to actually deploy the React app on the server. Currently I'm inside my React Playground uh, project and uh, I'm going to build the project so that we can deploy it on the server. So we built the project with the pmpm build command. The build command prepares and builds your project for it to be deployed in the production. And it also creates the dist folder. Now let's upload the dist folder to our VPS. For this we can use the ssh copy command. We recursively copy the content of the dist directory to our VPS located at this location. We use the root user and we provide the IP address. Additionally after the colon we provide the location where the dist folder should be copied to. We execute this one. We can see that the content of the dist folder has been copied. Here I'm connected to the VPS with SSH. If we go inside the folder where uh, the dist folder has been copied to, we can see that uh, the dist folder is there. With this command, we're going to serve our React app. And for this, we're going to use serve and uh, we're going to provide the location of the dist directory. Additionally, we have to use no hub command for the serve command to run in the background. If we close the SSH connection or the terminal, the serve command is going to be killed. So for this uh, to run in the background, we need the application no hub. We execute this one. We can see that uh, the process has been started. If we take a look into the serve.log file, we can see that we can access the website with localhost 3000. Instead of localhost, we are going to use the IP address of the VPS. Here we can see that we are accessing the application with the IP address and the port 3000. That's it, your React app is now live and ready for testing and demo. Stay tuned and I will see you in the next one, inshallah.